Now at this stage of the course, hopefully you're seeing the power of an array and how it actually connects quite well with the use of strings. And especially when we deal with CSV files. Now for those of you that are unfamiliar, these are comma separated values. And let me give you an example of how this works. So I'll start off with a string. And in my string, I'll just pop some names in here. So I'll have John, Sarah, Ken, Ben, and Amy. Now those names are separated by commas. So in a very simple way, this is actually a CSV file. Now what I need to do or want to do is to convert this into an array and my array will be called names. And to convert this into an array, I explode it. Now I explode it at a certain point and the point at which I explode is called the delimiter. And the delimiter in this case is the space and the comma. So comma space. And then what am I exploding? I am exploding the string. Now all I want to do is I want to print that to the screen. So print R, it's an array. So we use print R and we're printing names. And just to make things a little easier to read, again, I'll echo a pre-tag. Save that. Go to my browser and I'll refresh. And there I have my array of names. Now that I've exploded these names, I can actually implode them again to bring them back into a single string. And the way that's done is as follows. Let's call this imploded. So it's just a variable name and that will be equal to implode. Now I need my glue and my glue is whatever character I'm going to use. So my glue will be a pipe character and I'm going to implode the names array. And again, I'm going to echo and I'm going to echo imploded. I'll save that. Go to my browser and refresh. And there you can see we've got the original array. And now I've imploded that with the pipe character.